Hello, my beautiful Aries. I welcome you to one of our special readings. This time, our special reading is dedicated for all of you who are looking for blessings in their lives. As well, we are in the new moon in Gemini, and this reading will be posted on a weekend. So let's look what blessings brings this new moon as we speak right now by the end of the month or in the month that you are seeing this video so blessings for the month brought to you by spirit by the universe keep in mind these messages these energies are for general audience might be for you might be for the energy you are in and might not be as much take it accordingly loves so let's see aries what blessings brings to you the universe as we speak right now by the end of this month so we have king of swords underneath one of the blessings right away comes out and those blessings are clarity. King of Swords is crystal clear, whatever they want to do or how to proceed forward. As well, very clear into what's next. Five of Pentacles and Five of Wands. And the full. Another blessing that I'm seeing here right away is many, many of you Aries, you are not gonna engage in some kind of situation any longer. Or a situation that really, really was very heavy doesn't affect you any longer. You are in the full energy. Whatever here were heavy or chaos, not any longer. It's not for you any longer. It's not with you any longer and so on. So definitely I see you kind of leaving behind a crowd. So quite a blessing when you realize that if it's a low vibration, I'm not going to be there. Eight of Swords, the first card here. So definitely here, if you felt you can't move from a situation, now you will. Four of Cups, Two of Swords, Star, and Ace of Pentacles. So crystal clear, two major arcanas here, the star and the full. I want something new, even I didn't see from till, till now, whatever is there. Now I do, and I'm gonna move forward. So that's beautiful, loves. For some of you, I feel here you, you could try to manage certain things or work on certain things. For some of you, you could have Aquarius in the chart. Or since the Pluto was in retrograde in Aquarius, now is in Capricorn. But indeed here, something you, you couldn't manage, you couldn't see. For some of you, it's... It's that realization that it's not up to me to make things work. If it was on me, long time was okay. Long time was done. So that's the Ace of Pentacles here for. On the move. Making plans for the future. Moving towards a new beginning. Indeed, here with the Fool, you are definitely leave something behind. Why you couldn't see? Yes, we are in the new moon. But till now, why you couldn't see? 
nine of cups it's kind of i wanted something here definitely to work it's not the thing here you couldn't see it's more likely i i tried something but that was not entirely up to me another thing here what i'm feeling for some of you probably for a good period of time were okay the situation but now it's not Knight of Wands, Eight of Pentacles. So yes, for um, a good period of time, we're working, and you definitely wanted to to put more or have more. But it seems here that doesn't longer serve you. Whatever it is or how things develop let's see the blessings for the new beginning look at here underneath the full we have another five the five of cups the five of swords is the one missing loves and the five of swords really speaks about jealousy you know, lying and things like that. But also the, the Five of Swords speaks about for the selfish reasons, certain things here were not. So selfishness doesn't speak of we work, you know, both sides or both sides we can work things. So definitely here there was one-sided energy. Yeah, with the Eight of Pentacles also there is lessening certain learn certain lessons here. The Ace of Pentacles, the new energy here. Six of Swords, movement. So the biggest blessing here is learning a lesson, knowing clear what you want and Keep moving on it. Absolutely. With the two of pentacles, there is some some certainty out there that it will work or not, will work or not, will be good or not, will be what I want or not. Well, six of wands really speaks off. Yes, you got this. The universe is here to help you to navigate through, to move forward and definitely to be successful in whatever you put your mind to speaking about the mind because king of swords is very mental out there so whatever you put in your mind love keep doing keep going keep growing so don't even doubt if this will be good or if this decision of moving forward it's good Gemini energy since we are in the Gemini new moon right now. One of the best advices we can have for you regards this energy. Temperance. Temperance also speaks about Archangel Michael and also the star speaks about Archangel Gabriel. Know that you are protected but take your time, be balanced or focus on balance. For some of you, moving forward, there is balance restoring into your life. So it's a very beautiful, uplifting energy and definitely here speaking about the good, the good energy we are need to focus on. Yeah, look at this Libra energy balance. One more card. And the Hierophant. One more card. Three major arcana, let's see. And the Six of Pentacles. Definitely here it's about balance and movement and realizing what's best for you. Another thing here, what I'm seeing with the, the justice and the hierophant, make sure this is 
rational war in a rational way for yourself. Because restoring balance, you are restoring much more than just balance. So work through loves because you can move forward. There's another thing here is whatever in the past were really matter, the opinion of others or how others will see you now is not going to matter much because that's not fulfilling you or that's not serving you in any way. So loves, here we are. Another thing here, as you see, we've seen the Gemini, which is the number six, but also we have here the six of wands, six of swords and six of pentacles. The one missing is six of cups. And the six of cups really speaks about never do the things like you used to. So that's a great blessing here for you to not continue the same old, same old. So enjoy your loves and move forward. Allow this movement. For some of you, there is a blessing here that moving forward, you will avoid a big failure. So even though it's hard to believe so, later on you will understand that doing so or whatever you are doing now it's necessary later on you'll realize oh could be worse than that or i definitely avoid that big fall so for that being congrats loves to do so and understand that movement it's always for growth it's always for exchange of the energy and so on. And yes, the number five inclusive, the higher fan, which is the number five, speaks about the, the motion as we didn't see any longer the five of swords. This is a very quick move for some of you to believe in the movement. That's also, it's a blessing because whatever you could not move away from, now you can. So the universe gives you that, that ability, that opportunity to move forward. Yes, for some of you, you are moving on from someone who put you in a third party or were being in and out. Whatever it's here, definitely it's a huge, big lesson so Aries that's what I have for you these are the blessings that are coming forward enjoy and happy new moon don't forget to manifest big and of course if you really enjoy or feel that this energy speaks to you don't hesitate to subscribe like share it and if you really want to get in touch with us, everything is in the description box. See ya loves. Namaste.